news never ends. This is 1080 GCR. You get all the news you need all day long. Good morning. It's 42 degrees at 10.30 on this Thursday, October 15th. I'm Stan L. Brooks, and here's what's happening. It's day 18 of the garbage you like. With 10,000 tons of garbage piling up every day, even the nicest sections of the city are looking like slums. Health Commissioner Edward O'Rourke is declaring a citywide state of emergency for the first time in decades. There's no need to wait until somebody dies or comes down with typhoid fever. It's already a serious situation. It's something that affects almost everyone in the city, no matter who they are or where they live. You can't go down no, no one avenue without seeing nothing but garbage and rats. It's starting to affect my business when customers can't get in here because of the garbage situation. I'm not out that long to smell it, but I think to look at it, it's terrible. It don't affect me except for the, the very bad smell here. It's horrific. It's a mess. I've been in this country for 50 years, and I've never seen anything like it. What is this world coming to? Put them in a room, let them sit there and talk till they get it over with. 24 hours, 48 hours, how long it takes. The idea of the National Guard building in and cleaning up is a good idea. In other news, the building industry and landlords today expressed concern over the latest increase in heating oil prices. Renters in the metro area are certain to feel the pain. <laughs> <laughs> is it just me or is it getting crazier out there it is certainly tense hmm. people are upset they're struggling looking for work 
These are tough times. How about you? Have you been keeping up with your journal? Yes, ma'am. Great. Did you bring it with you? Arthur, last time I asked you to bring your journal with you for these appointments. Can I see it? I've been using it as a as a journal, but also as a joke diary. Funny thoughts or observations. I think I told you I'm pursuing a career in stand-up comedy. No, you didn't. I think I did. I just hope my death makes more sense than my life. How does it feel to have to come here? Does it help to have someone to talk to? I think I felt better when I was locked up in the hospital. And have you thought more about why you were locked up? Who knows? I was wondering if you could ask the doctor to increase my medication. Arthur, you're on seven different medications. Surely they must be doing something. I just don't want to feel so bad anymore. Oh, <laughs> 